Hey, goal getters, this is Tony Woodall, your host for Goal Getting Podcast and the Goal Getting Quote of the Day. I really do appreciate you listening to our shows. And I'd like to thank Brandon Clay for the five star rating on iTunes and his wonderful review. Brandon says, Get your mind playing for your team. Love the line. It's so true that measuring is the first step to doing. Keep up the great work, Tony. Thanks, Brandon. I really do appreciate that. And Brandon is referring to the episode where I talked about how we have to stop letting our mind play goalie for the other team. You know how it is when you're getting ready to start or achieve a goal and your mind comes up and starts that negative stinking thinking and like the goalie for the other team just kind of slaps down your goal. Bam! You know, and then, you know, you just really stop doing it or whatever. So don't let your mind play goalie for the other team. But that's not our quote for today. We did that one a few days ago, actually. Today's quote is one that my friend Bo Henderson of The Rich Life recommended on the podcast the other day. And if you haven't listened to Bo, you can find his podcast interview by going to our website and searching for Bo, B-E-A-U, or entering goalgettingpodcast.com slash Bo, B-E-A-U, and listen to his interview where he talks about the 10 investments for true wealth and helps you learn to live the rich life. Bo's quote is from William James, an American philosopher and the father of American psychology. The greatest use of life is to spend it for something that will outlast it. Now, isn't that what we want to be able to do? You know, leave a legacy, whether it be for our children, our family, or just the world in general. We've had a couple of great guests lately that talk about living the rich life and living on purpose. And I think this is something that many of us strive for. It's something that has been resonating with me lately, and as one of my mentors and friend Aaron Walker talks about, we should strive to grow from success to significance. Now, are you using your life to spend it for something that will outlast it? Thank you again for listening to Goal Getting Podcast, where every Wednesday we provide guests or information that will help you get the goals you set. One of the things that Brandon Clay was talking about in his review on iTunes was that it is true that measuring is the first step to doing. That's one of the major steps that we teach at Goal Getting Podcast, measuring your goals. And setting up your action plan and then doing daily measurements of them to ensure that you do them. Part of the measurements include paying yourself or rewarding yourself for achieving those steps. And if you'd like a copy of our Goal Getting Measurement Worksheet, you can go to goalgettingpodcast.com slash measure and let us know your email address so that we can email you your copy. And that's goalgettingpodcast.com slash measure, M-E-A-S-U-R-E. And I do appreciate you listening, and I want you to go ahead and have a great day and make it a great day because you have the ability to make it great. And, you know, again, the greatest use of life is to spend it for something that will outlast it. And I hope you can do that and have a wonderful time. And again, thank you so much for listening. This is Tony Woodall with Goal Getting Podcast, and we'll see you soon.